That sounds impossible, but what you just said actually makes sense. <laughs> Look, the sooner you realize I'm a genius, the better off we'll both be. Even after you saw my book. <laughs> You're lonely. I think it's cute and endearing. Um, I think you mean gross and appalling? Okay, what do I want in a guy? Ah, Olympic gold medalist. Someone who doesn't talk to the help. Ooh, doesn't look like Eric. If you're serious about this list, maybe you should pick qualities that are a little more realistic. Ah, you're right. Yeah, you're right. No fatties, no baldies. Michael's just after me all the time. I mean, I understand because I'm sexy you now, but still. I love it when Eric holds me. Yeah, yeah, I love it when Michael buys me stuff. Um, I guess Fez really got me with all of the poems that he left in my locker. Oh, that is so romantic. Well, doesn't Kelso write you poems? No, no, but he's not foreign. Okay, maybe you should spend less time worrying about being popular and more time being thoughtful, friendly, considerate. Okay, can I get a translation? Because that was gibberish. Here's what I don't get. Why would Sally sell seashells down by the seashore? I mean, that's a terrible location for a seashell stand. Okay, bye. He usually gives me a kiss goodbye. Yeah, to be honest, kind of grosses me out. Maybe I'm just lonely. Or I need a sign from, like, God. Or I don't know. Maybe I just need someone to tell me if I'm crazy. Jackie, you're crazy. <laughs> Not you, Bigfoot. Done it yet? Yeah, we did it and I forgot to mention it. <laughs> uh, so what's the hold up? Whatever. It'll happen when it happens. Yeah. I guess if I were Eric's girlfriend, I would not be in a hurry to do it either. <laughs> what's going on with you and your stripper wife? You guys are fighting like cats and whores. Well, I guess it's true what they say. Keep your friends close and your enemies fat. <laughs> it's better to have loved and lost than to be but ugly. When is Michael gonna ask me? I can't stand the anticipation. This must be how fat girls feel between placing their order and getting their fries. They're arguing and arguing and arguing. Okay. No offense, Donna, but all this talk about your mom and dad fighting, well, it's boring me. <laughs> Jack, you couldn't find anything? Okay, well, no offense, Hyde, but all your mother's clothes are hoary. <laughs> what? Oh, but they look great on you, Donna. Thanks, Jack. Hey, Donna. <laughs> Sorry I'm late. I didn't want to come over until all my other options for the night fell through. <laughs> Good to see you, too, Jackie. <laughs> You know, normally I wouldn't cry in your sweater because, you know, it ruins the fabric. But God, this was just so cheap, it won't matter. The person I love most is me. I love me most. You choose you? Look, if I could run across the beach into my own arms, I would. How could I be runner-up? If I'm not a rich, popular girl, I'm nothing. I'm like Donna! <laughs> oh, honey, it's blush, not spray paint. <laughs> but Donna, you look great. What could it be? <gasps> oh, I know! You lost 80 pounds of ugly fat! Ha <laughs> ha! Burn, Eric, burn! Could you be any more annoying? Yes. <laughs> look, Eric and I want one weekend alone where we don't have to be so secret about being engaged. I can't even wear my ring if it weren't being resized for me. Can they make a ring big enough to fit your Paul Bunyan hands? Donna, what's wrong? You look sad. I think Eric thinks I'm boring. Do you think I'm boring? Yeah, a little. 
but it's not like it's a bad thing. The world needs people like you. You're the gray that makes the color me pop. Hi, Jackie. Oh, look, it's Michael in his community chest. I mean, I say this right because I am new to English. <laughs> but she has tremendous breath, yes? <laughs> Who is this guy? Well, that's Fez. He's a foreign exchange student. Who do we exchange for him? <laughs> well, it's just I'm in the middle of this really good book. Donna's books are for prisoners. I can't wait until all of Donna's giant clothes are out of the closet. I don't even go in there now. I'm afraid I'll fall into one of her shoes and never be heard from again. <laughs> you better watch your back. Really? Cause you, she stopped spending so much time on yours. <laughs>